Hi! In today's tutorial, I am going to cover a crucial step in the video editing process, exporting and importing your projects in CapCut. Whether you're working on a collaborative project, switching devices, or simply wanting to back up your work, knowing how to export and import your CapCut projects is essential. In this video, I'll be walking you through a step-by-step -step guide on how to do just that. So I'm here in the CapCut start window. Here you can simply duplicate projects. But how the hell do you export or import projects? There must be an export button somewhere. Perhaps in the file menu. Indeed, thanks God. Well, let's export the project. Home. Exporting does not mean the actual exporting of a project, but the rendering of the final video. And when importing, clips are added instead of importing a real CapCut project. Before I show you a workaround how to export CapCut projects and import them to another computer, Let's see how the other video edit applications do it. To export a project in DaVinci Resolve, simply press the export button. Now, let me quickly delete this project and showcase you how to import a project. Now press the import button. Select the project file. Wait a few seconds. Done. This is how you can easily export and import a video project in DaVinci. OK, now let's see how to export a project in CapCut. First open the project you want to export, perhaps to finish it on another computer, or to give it to Iman Gatji so that he can polish it for you. Once you have opened a project, you will find the path to the project files in the top right hand corner of CapCut. Fire up Windows Explorer and navigate to the path displayed in CapCut. If you cannot see the Updata folder, set the option to show hidden files. Within the local folder, there is another folder called CapCut, and this folder contains the user data that contains the CapCut project files. These are all the projects that can also be seen on the start screen. Select a folder then copy it to the other computer, or somewhere else for backup. Now move the folder to the same path as before. Start HapCart and see what happens. The project appears magically in the start windows of CapCut. Don't be shy and give it a go. Okay, I see. I forgot to copy the clips, pictures and sounds as well. Cancel the dialogue and close the main window of CapCut. Navigate to the folder containing the clips of the video project and copy them as well. Paste the folder somewhere. Open the project again. Select a missing file and link it to the new location. If everything works as expected, the other missing elements should also be found. Very nice. You have successfully exported a CapCut video project and imported it to another computer. I think CapCut should add an import and export function to avoid this tedious way. What do you guys think? Leave a comment below 